All right, so here we're gonna go over a passive dorsiflexion drill. You're gonna get started with the thigh beside the opposite foot, and then we're gonna roll forward, chest onto the thigh, and try to close that gap between the shin and the top of the foot, which is characterized as dorsiflexion. So when you're in this position, you wanna make sure that you're maintaining alignment from foot to knee and hip. A lot of times people will get into this position and will be all crooked with the knee crossing the body. You may still feel a stretch in this position, but it's really not achieving what we're trying to uh, target. So foot, knee, hip in line, and then roll forward, put some pressure through that thigh to assist in that dorsiflexion. And you should feel your Achilles, you should feel your soleus as you fall forward. The heel can be slightly off the ground, and as you apply that pressure from your chest into your thigh, you want to try to let that heel settle down towards the floor. 